Hotline. Today we're talking about Marvel Mystery Comics 70th Anniversary Special. The, the special gathers a lot of uh, comic book characters who used to be featured in the early days of Marvel Mystery Comics. It involves uh, the Submariner, the Human Torch, the Ferret, Electro, and the Angel. The Submariner uncovers a plot by the Nazis. They've developed the super weapon that not only threatens the surface world, but could eventually threaten his undersea kingdom. The one character everyone asks me about is the ferret. He was actually a mystery author who consulted with the police. Um, he was a private investigator and had a series that appeared in the early days of Marvel Mystery Comics. I stumbled upon him by going through the, the Marvel Masterworks collections of Marvel Mystery Comics. I think the character that really appealed to me the most in the special was Toro, the Flaming Kid, because he was a smart mouth who didn't uh, have any respect for authority. Writing a Golden Age story is, is a lot different from writing any other story. To be honest, every individual story calls for its own style, its own technique, and its own frame of reference and, and just mental... Um, yeah, I don't know what to call it. <laughs> mental hoo-ha. Um, so I try to write every indi individual story in an individual style. Chris Burnham did a terrific job. He not only captured the mood of the early 1940s, but he brought a special life to each one of these characters. They all come across as distinct individuals with distinct personalities, which is what you like in an artist. Uh, we worked Marvel style, which means I gave him a plot, and then he interpreted the action visually. And I think he did a terrific job. Thanks for listening. This is Tom DeFalco, and this is Marvel, your universe. Thanks for calling. Check back next week for more Marvel Hotline. Marvel, your universe.